yesterday and the day before. So I haven't been running for like a long time. And so <clears throat> on a couple days ago, I decided I was like, okay, it's time to just try it out. See how I feel. I've been healing for a long time. I had knee injury. And so I was like, all right, let's see how, how she's doing. So I went on a run and, um, I felt okay, um, during, and then after I had, I was, I could barely walk. My legs were just like so fatigued and I was just, oh my God. And it was just this feeling. I felt so, um, I felt so humbled, you know, I was like, oh man, I used to just get up and go. And now I'm just like, you know, it's not the same anymore. And so I felt really defeated at first. So then yesterday I went on my walk and I was like, okay, on the tail end, I'll just kind of like jog a little bit. So on the tail end, I started jogging and, um, and I just thought to myself, I was like, what if you just go slow? What if you just go really slow and you don't try and be what you used to be? You just are a new version of you. What if you just let yourself do that? And so I probably was going at like snail's grandma's pace and I made it all the way to the end of what I said I was going to do. Was I the same that I used to be when I was running hardcore? No, absolutely not. And I probably look at myself when I was running hardcore and look at that chick. Oh my God. You know, like, wow, she's really, really going for it today. You know, and I, and I just was like, wow, so humbled. And I didn't feel bad about myself. I actually took it and I was like, wow, I'm learning. Like, I'm learning not to judge. I'm learning, you know, myself or other people. I have no idea what their story is. They don't know that I used to run 100 miles a week. They have no idea. And it doesn't matter either because I don't anymore. And that's just not my life. And so that's okay. And so I wanted to share that with you because I just think it's good for us to remind ourselves that we're learning even when we think we're actually taking steps back. We're learning through being humble. We're learning through the changes and the ebbs and flows of of aging <laughs> and just of all the things around. It's not bad. It's actually a cause for celebration because you're improving in so many ways. So I thought I'd share that a little bit with you. Other than that, full body flow today. Um, we've been working into a lot of handstand hops. So even today, don't judge yourself on how high you get or how high you don't get. Just try and just see how that feels, okay? Other than that, let's have some fun. Let's get started in child's pose. All right. Take a full breath in. Full breath out. Again, full breath in. Full breath out. One more time like that, full breath in, full breath out. And then start to roll forward to hands and knees. Inhale, cow, drop the belly, lift the gaze. Exhale, cat, round tuck and curl the spine. Inhale, cow. Exhale, cat. Then inhale, cow. Exhale, cat. Come back to neutral right hand, right knee is your base, modified side plank, lift. Lengthen, lift your left arm and reach for three, two, and one switch. Lift your right arm, extend, three, two, one hand down, knee down. Send your left leg back, reach your right arm forward. Exhale, elbow to knee. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, elbow to knee. Inhale, lengthen. Bend your left knee, look over your right shoulder, grab your foot. Big kick, we're here for four, three, two, one. Drop your hand, but keep your leg lifted. Leg out to the side, hold right here, extend the foot. So lengthen. And then bend the knee, close it off, lift the leg back up behind you, open the leg to the side, kick the leg out, re-bend the knee, close it off, leg back behind you, out to the side, kick, hold right here, four, three, 
Two, drop your foot out to the side and then push your hips back. Reach your fingertips to the far right corner of your mat. Really good. Come all the way back up, lift the leg, bend the knee, close it down and drop the knee. Send your right leg back, lift, reach your left arm forward. Exhale, elbow to knee. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, elbow to knee. Inhale, lengthen. One more, exhale, elbow to knee. Lengthen, bend your right knee, look over your left shoulder, grab your foot. Hold here for three, big kick. Two, one, drop your hand, but keep your leg lifted. Leg out to the side, kick the leg out, hold it. Rebend the knee, close it off. Lift the leg back behind you, open out to the side, extend, rebend, close it off. One more time. Leg back behind you, out to the side, extend and hold. Four, three, to drop your foot and then push your hips back. Take your fingertips to the far right, left or right of the mat, drop your head. <sighs> and then come all the way back up, hands underneath you, lift your leg, bend the knee, close it off, tabletop pose, downward facing dog. Push your hips back, full breath in. Full breath out. And then bend your knees, look forward, come to the top. You can walk, step, or hop. Totally up to you. Relax your head a little bit more. Deepen your breath. And we'll take a halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Guys, right, so stand mountain. Bring your hands to heart space. Just take a moment, find your intention. Good, inhale your arms lift. Take a back bend at the top. Inhale, arms lift. Swan dive forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Hop back to plank. Lower down halfway, exhale, press up. Lower down halfway, exhale, press up. Lower through up dog, and press back to down dog. Bend your left knee, straighten your right leg, and switch. Come back to center, bend your knees, look forward, big hop to the top. Inhale, half lift, exhale, fold. Rise to stand, mountain. Back bend, exhale. Inhale, lift. Swan dive, forward fold. Inhale, half lift. Plant, hop back, and float, Chaturanga. Just a simple sun to wake us up this morning. Use your breath as you move. Down dog, bend your left knee. Switch. Bend both knees, inhale, exhale, hop forward, inhale, halfway lift, exhale, fold, rise to stand, mountain, back bend, exhale, inhale, arms lift, swan dive forward, fold, inhale, half lift, plant hop back to plank, chaturanga. Please try and link up to your breath. Bend your left knee, straighten your right leg. Exhale, switch. Bend both knees, look forward, big hop to the top. Starting to add on here, inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Come into chair, sit low. Good, lift your arms above your head. Holding here for four, three, two. On one, bring your hands to your heart, come to your toes. Sink a little bit lower. Holding for four. Three, two, on one, heels down, left knee comes up and in. Keep your knee coiled into the body. Find your balance, hold, here for four. Three, two, 
On one, extend the leg forward and extend your arms forward. Hold here, find your balance, find your control for four, three, two, recoil. Take your first finger and your thumb together and keep them at your heart. Open your leg out to the side, pause, flex the toe. Engage the hip to open up a little bit more. Engage the core here for four, three, two, and one. Kick the leg out, extend the arms out. Keep the first finger and your thumb connected here for four, three, two, re-bend, hands to heart, and then tilt the hip down and the body down, and then lift the hip, tuck your right shoulder under. We did this on Wednesday. Stay here for four, three, two, one, right hand underneath you, half moon, left hand comes to your hip, roll the hip back. Just kind of find this place where you're balanced, but you're still controlled. Exhale, Shiva squat, left knee back of right calf, connect the fingertips, find your balance, find your control, here for four, three, two, one. Standing split, handstand hop. So the hands come underneath you, bend your knees, come to your right tippy toes, hop, and then land really light back into that Shiva squat five times. Hop, come back down, hop, come back down, two more, hop, come back down, one more, hop, come back down, both feet together, back into your chair, under your toes, hands to heart. Holding, sit low, four, lots of focus as we start, three, two, one, heels down, right knee comes up and in, Hold here, first finger and your thumb connect, keep them at your heart space. Try and stay in your body. Start, just try and like not think about something outside of this moment. Think about how you feel. <sighs> extend the foot, extend the arms. Keep the first finger and your thumb connected. Here for four, lift that leg a little higher. Three, two, one, bend your knee, recoil. Open the leg out to the side. But keep the knee bent, flex the toe up. Roll the shoulders down the back, engage the core, pull your right knee higher. Here for four, three, two, one. You're gonna just lower your body halfway down, but keep your right leg lifting. And then tuck your left shoulder under you, roll your right shoulder back, lift your right leg a little more. Here for four, engage your core. Three, two, half moon, left hand down, right hand to hip, roll it back, roll it open. Here for four, Keep finding that length, three, two, one, Shiva squat. Connect first finger, first finger and your thumb together. Again, holding here for four, three, heel towards glute, two, one, standing split, handstand hop. So let's start with standing split and then bend your knees, come to your left tippy toes, and then kick to hop and lift and land lightly. Five, kick, four, three, Two, and one, both feet down together. Right back into your chair. Widen the stance of your feet about hip width distance apart. Come to your toes, sink low. Hips are gonna come all the way to the heels. And then your knees are gonna lower down to the mat. Trust your balance, find your focus. Lift your whole body, hands to the top of your hips. Lean back, here for four. Roll the shoulders down the back. Three, two, one, come all the way back up, lift your knees off the mat, hands to the mat, crow pose, lean forward. Here for four, if you have headstand, feel free to go there. Three, two, one, hop back and flow, chaturanga. Warming up. So good, here for a big breath in, big breath out. Getting big breath in. Big breath out. Inhale your right leg high. Come to wild thing. Roll all the way around. Lower your hips. Lift your hips back up. Take four arm circles with your right arm. And then right hand comes down to the mat. Right leg high. Exhale right tricep. Right leg high. Exhale left tricep. Right leg high. Exhale right tricep. Inhale, right leg high. Exhale, left tricep, pause. Spin to the inside of your left foot. Left elbow, right knee, connect. Extend your foot, extend your arm. For three, 
to drop your foot right into your fallen triangle. Lift for four, three, two, come all the way back around, three-legged dog, right leg high, take a little hop, and step to the outside of your right hand for low runner's lunge or dragon lunge. Pause here and lengthen, you just kind of like lean forward and back a couple times. Good. Three, two, drop your back knee down, half split, sit back, let your head drop. Rebend your front knee, tuck the back toe, lift the knee. Skandasana to your left, walk your hands all the way over. Flex your right toes up, point your left toes back. Here for four, three, two, one, bend your right knee, come into low lunge. <clears throat> Keep your hands planted in front of you, and then bend your left knee, pull it into Shiva squat. Bring your fingertips together, find your balance, find your control. Sink a little bit deeper here for three, two, one, rise all the way up into balance. Send the leg forward, send your arms forward. Pause, three, two, one, rebend. Open leg to the side, pause for the inhale. On the exhale, extend a hold, four, three, two, rebend, hands to heart, tilt the body down, the hip lifts, roll your right shoulder under you. Inhale. Find half moon, right hand down, left hand to hip on your exhale. Hold for three, two, back to Shiva squat, fingertips connect. Stay for the inhale. Hands to the mat, standing split handstand hops, five. Five, land lightly. Four, three, two, one. We're gonna come back to that Shiva and then step back into our High lunge, left leg back behind you, arms above your head. Keep pushing your left hip forward, right hip back. Interlace your hands together, and then take them to the nape of your neck. Draw back, push your elbows back. Imagine your shoulder blades could touch, spin the inner thighs together. Stay in your body, stay balanced. Here for four, three, two, one. Move from your core twisting to the right. So look to the right twist from your core and then let your shoulders lead you after your core has already twisted you enough and then extend your arms to an open arm twist look toward your right fingertips there for four three two exalt right hand left thigh left hand to the nape of your neck lean back engage your breath there for four three two on one, drop your back knee, left elbow, right knee, right into your low twist. So revolved lunge, hands at prayer, tuck the back toe, lift your back knee. Holding here, you can look past your shoulder for a little bit more challenge. Here for four, three, two, one. Look forward, step both feet together, chair twist. Stay here, look past the shoulder. Here for four, three, two and one come into chair widen the stance of your feet about hip width distance apart arms above you hands come to heart space sink your hips to your heels lower your knees all the way down to the mat lean your body back take your hands to the top of your hips lean back for four three two on one lift your knees back up hands to the mat crow pose or headstand holding for four Three, two, one, let's flow. Nice work. Downward facing dog, press it back. Full breath in, full breath out. Now your left leg high, wild thing, come all the way around, lower hips, lift hips, take forearm circles. Nice. Left hand comes down, left leg high. Inhale, left tricep on your exhale. Inhale, left leg high. Exhale, right tricep. Inhale, left leg high. Exhale, left tricep. Inhale, left leg high. Exhale to your right tricep, spin to the inside of your right foot. Connect your right elbow to your left knee. Pause. Kick the leg out, reach your right arm up, and then drop the foot for your Stargazer or fallen triangle. Here for three, 
two, one all the way back around to your three-legged dog, leg up, take a little hop, step to the outside of your left hand, dragon lunge, pause, sink low and just kind of lean forward and back. Just add some breath, add some breath. Enjoy how it feels to be in your body this morning. And then drop your back knee, half split, straighten your left leg, lean back, let your head drop. So three, two, and one. Rebend the left knee, tuck the back toe, lift your knee up, stand asana to your right. Make sure your right toes face back. Your left toes are pointing toward the sky, the ceiling. Push your right elbow to the inside of the right thigh. Flex your left toes. Three, two, on one. Rebend your left knee. Come to low lunge, fingertips in front of you. And then Shiva squat, right knee back of left calf. Hold here. Bring your fingertips to connect. Hands come to heart. Engage your core. For four, three, Two, come all the way up into balance. One breath in. Exhale, extend arms, extend leg. Here for four, plug it in. Three, two, one, recoil. Open the leg to the side, but keep it bent for a moment. Inhale, exhale, kick and extend your arms. Hold for four, three, two, rebend. Tilt the body down. Tuck your left shoulder under you. <laughs> Find your balance. Hold for the inhale. Now half moon, left hand comes down, right hand to your hip, roll it back. Pause, stay for the breath in. Exhale into your Shiva squat. Okay, hands will come underneath you. Standing split, and now come to your left tippy toe, bend the knee, handstand hops, five. Land light every time, five, four, three, two, one, come back into that Shiva squat. We're gonna step back into a lunge, high lunge. Arms come above your head. Lots of balance today, lots of focus. Engage your core, that will help. Interlace your hands together and then teeth into the nape of your neck. Straighten your back leg, engage your core. Shoulders down the back, arms spread wide. Deepen your breath. Come high on the ball line of your back toe. Yes. And then go ahead and twist to the left using your core first and then your upper body. And now extend your arms, squeeze your inner thighs together, open arm twist. Look at your left fingertips. Good. Here for four. Three, two, on one, drop your back knee down, hands at prayer, right elbow, left knee. All right, lift the back knee off the mat. Look past the shoulder, deepen your breath. You got this, stay here for four. Yeah, three, two, look down to the mat. Now step forward, both feet together, chair twist, hands at prayer. Hold here, keep looking past the shoulder for four, three, sink lower, two, one, come back into chair, come to your toes, widen the stance of your feet. Hands to heart space, hips sink to heels, focus. Drive the knees down to the mat, lean the body back. Three, two, one, lift the knees up. Hands to the mat, you're right into crow or headstand. Here for four, three, two, and one, right into your flow, chaturanga. And downward facing dog. Let's start to add on some more things, flowing breath and movement. Take a full breath in, full breath out. Inhale your right leg high. Wild thing, we come all the way around, lower your hips. Lift your hips. Right hand down, right leg high. Exhale, right tricep. Inhale, right leg high. Exhale, lift tricep. Inhale, right leg high. Exhale, right tricep. Right leg high, exhale left tricep, right leg high, right knee left tricep, pause, spin to the inside of your left foot, left elbow, right knee, extend, drop the foot, lift all the way up, expand. Three-legged dog, right leg high, 
Take a little hop. Step to the outside of your right hand. Drag and lunge. Pause here, lengthen. Exhale, drop your back knee, half split. We bend your front knee, tuck your back toe, lift the knee. Skandasana over to your left. Right arm lifts above you. Full breath in. Listen, go back to drag and lunge. Bend your right knee. Hands underneath you. Lean the body forward. Drop the back knee, half split. Rebend your front knee, tuck the toe, lift the knee. Skandasana to your left. You got it now. Right arm reaches up one more time. Right knee bends. Drag and lunge. Heart forward. Inhale. Drop the back knee. Half split on your exhale. Rebend your front knee. Tuck the back toe. Lift the knee. Skandasana to your left. Here's where we break the pattern. Right knee bends. Low lunge. Hands underneath you. Shiva squat. Left knee back of right calf. Fingertips connect. Focus on your balance. It's improving already. Pull the knee up and in. Kick the leg out. Recoil, knee back in. Open the leg out to the side, pause, extend. Come back in. Tilt the body down halfway. Roll the right shoulder underneath you, lift the left leg. Half moon, right hand comes down, left hand to your hip. Right back into your Shiva squat. Hands connect to the mat, come to your right tippy toes, five times, hop. Landing lighter each time, five, four, Three, two, and one. Step all the way back to high lunge. Arms come above you. Interlace the hands at your neck. Elbows back, shoulders back. Twist to the right. Open your arms. Exalt right hand, left thigh, lean back. Revolve lunge, left elbow, right knee, hands at prayer. Pause, stay for the inhale. On the exhale, look forward, step both feet together, chair twist, listen for the change. Hold right here for four, three, two, look down to the mat. Lift your left heel and then extend it back behind you. Focus on your balance, focus on the control. Hold here, keep the leg lifted, three, two, one, drop the foot and lift your arms above your head, high lunge. We are two, open all the way out. Pause here for four, three, two, reverse warrior, left hand down, right arm reaches up, lengthen your side body. Yeah, looks good, three, two, side angle pose, right arm down, left arm reaches. Here for four, three, two, skandasana to your left, come all the way down, you know this one, right arm reaches above your head. Yeah, deep breaths. Right into horse pose, hands on top of your thighs, lift your heels up, push your hips back. Good, arms come above you, full breath in. Hands will come underneath you and you're just gonna lift your hips. And I want you to imagine you're going in with cat and then to get upside down, you wanna tilt the pelvis and go into cow, okay? Arms come up, hands come down, pop up and come back down. So you really wanna focus on keeping the knees into the outside of the body. Don't just flail your legs up. Arms down, lift up, and back down. If you don't get that high, it's okay. Arms up, hands come down, pop up, and back down. Arms come up. Exhale, hands come down. One more time, arms come up. Hands come down, pop up, and come back into your horse. Hold your horse. Flip the palms to face up. Add a little bit of a pelvic tilt forward. Squeeze inner thighs, back, knees back, heels lift. Here for four, grounding, focusing. Three, two, heels down, rise up to star. Right knee bends, warrior two. Reverse warrior, inhale. Hands come down to low lunge on your exhale. Right leg high. Wild thing all the way around, lower the hips. Lift the hips, right leg high, over to the left tricep, fallen triangle. Extend the leg, lift the left arm. And come all the way around to flow, chaturanga. Awesome work so far. <sighs> Downward facing dog. I don't know why anybody who's a runner does not do yoga. <laughs> 
It is so, so good. Inhale, left leg high. I already feel like a new woman. Wild thing, come all the way back around. Lower your hips. Lift the hips. Left leg high, inhale. Left tricep on your exhale. Inhale, left leg high. Exhale, right tricep. Inhale, left leg high. Exhale, left tricep. Inhale, left leg high. Exhale, right tricep, pause. Spin to the inside of your right foot. Right elbow connects to left knee. Extend the foot, extend the arm. All the way up through your ball and triangle. Three-legged dog, left leg high, take a hop. Step to the outside of your left hand. Low dragon lunge. Pause right here. Full breath in. Drop the back knee, half split, straighten the leg. Rebend the knee, tuck the toe, lift the knee. Skandasana to your right. Left arm lifts, full breath in. Drag and lunge, left knee bends again. Pull the heart forward, full breath in. Drop the back knee, half split. Rebend your left knee, tuck the toe, lift your knee. Skandasana to your right. Left arm lifts above you. One more time like that, drag and lunge, left knee bends, hands on the inside of the thigh. Drop the back knee, half split. Rebend the knee, lift the back knee. Skandasana over to your right. Here's where we break the loop. Left knee bends, low lunge, hands underneath you. Shiva squat, right knee back of left calf, fingertips connect. Lift up, inhale. Exhale the leg forward. Rebend the knee. Open leg out to the side. Extend. Pull back in. Tilt the body down. Roll the left shoulder underneath you. Lift your right hip. Half moon. Shiva squat, hands to the mat, standing split, handstand hops, five, land light every time, four, three, two, giant step back to high lunge on one, arms come above you, interlace the hands at your neck, lengthen your back leg, turn to face the left, twist the body. Extend your arms out. Exalt, left hand, right thigh, lean back. Hand to the nape of your neck. Revolve lunge, right elbow, left knee. Hold here, inhale, press the hands together on your exhale. Look forward, step both feet together, pause, stay here, remember the change. Here for three, two, one, look down to the mat, pull your right heel into your glute. Pause, four, three, Two, extend the foot all the way back, but keep it lifted. Four, three, two, drop the foot behind you. Holding here, four, three, two, high lunge, arms above you, whoo. Weird two, open all the way out. Drop the back heel, extend the arms, get into your body, stay present. Shoulders down the back. Here for four, three, two, one, reverse your warrior, lift your left arm, hold right here. Here for four, three, two, one, side angle, left arm comes down, right arm reaches above you. Maybe reach it all the way forward. Keep lengthening, here for four, maybe gazing up, three, two, one, skandasana to your right, come all the way over. Lift your left arm, holding for four, Three, two, one. Come into your horse, but you're on your toes to start. So just like last time. Grounding down, you wanna think cat to cow when you get your hands down underneath you, okay? Arms come above you. Hands dive down, lift your hips. Keep your knees tucked in. Don't just flail your legs out. Come back to start, ends up. Hands down, lift, and come back down. Arms up. Hands down, lift up, land lightly, come back up. Hands down, lift up, land lightly. One more time. Hands down, hop up, and land lightly. Good. This time adding on just that little pelvic tilt we did on Wednesday. So tuck the hip under you, roll the shoulders and round the spine, and then come the other way. More like 
cow. And then cat, you're on your toes the whole time. Cow to cat. Again, cow to cat. Heels down, rise up to star, full breath in. Left knee bends, we're two. Reverse your warrior, lift your left arm. Hands to the ground, low lunge. Left leg high. Wild thing, come all the way around, lower hips. Lift your hips. Left leg high. Over to the right, tricep, fall in a broken triangle. Lift the hips. Right hand down, left leg high, flow chaturanga. Maybe you're feeling extra good. You want to pop it up through a couple handstand hops. Who knows? Downward facing dog. Just get a little creative with your flow. I'm going to flow all of that breath and movement when you are ready. Full breath in. Full breath out. Right leg high. Wild thing. Come all the way around. Lower hips. Lift hips. Right leg high. Right tricep on your exhale. Right leg high. Exhale, left tricep. Right leg high. Exhale, right tricep. Right leg high. Exhale, left tricep. Right leg high. Again to the left tricep, spin to the inside of the foot. Elbow to knee. Extend foot, extend arm. Three-legged dog, right leg high. Take a hop. Step to the outside of your right hand. Low dragon lunge, pause. Drop the back knee, half split, sit back. Rebend the front knee, tuck the toe, lift the knee off the mat. Skandasana to your left. Focus on your breath, link it up, right arm up. Right knee bends, back to dragon lunge. Hands on the inside of the foot, lengthen. Drop the back knee, half split. Rebend the knee. Tuck the back toe, lift the knee. Skandasana to the left, right arm reaches above the head or maybe diamond shape. Right knee bends. Right back in, dragon lunge. Drop the back knee, half split. Right bend the knee. Skandasana to your left. This time, diamond shape, right to low lunge. Hands are at your heart the whole time. Right knee bends. Yes, there we go. Hands to the mat. Shiva squat, hands come back to heart. Lift your left knee. Extend. Back in. Open the leg out to the side. Extend the arms, extend the leg. Back in. Roll the body down halfway. Roll the shoulder under you, lift the leg. Half moon, left hand to hip. Back to Shiva squat, five hops, hands down. Five, we practice for a reason. Four. Three. Two, getting better. And one, step all the way back to our high lunge. Arms come above your head. Interlace the hands at your neck. Twist to the right. Open your arms. Exalted lunge, right hand, left thigh, full inhale. Exhale, revolve lunge, left elbow, right knee, hands at prayer. Hold here, stay for the inhale. On the exhale, look forward, step both feet together. Chair twist, fly your arms or side curl. Holding here for four, three, two, look down, lift your left heel, send it all the way back. Drop the foot, revolve lunge, hold for the inhale, high lunge on your exhale. Inhale, warrior two on your exhale. Nice, reverse warrior, inhale, lift. Side angle on your exhale. Stand asana to your left. Listen, come into horse. Come to your toes. Just one time, lift your heels. Hands come down, add a hop. Pop it up, back down, come back in. And we loop that again, rise up to star, inhale. Right knee bends, warrior two, exhale. Reverse warrior, inhale. Side angle, exhale. Inhale, stand asana to the left on your exhale. Right arm reaches above you or maybe diamond shape. Right into your horse pose, come to your toes, arms above you. Hands to the mat, hop, lift, come back down. Heels down, lift to star, one more loop, right knee bends, warrior two. Reverse warrior, inhale. Side angle, exhale. 
Skandasana to your left. You're doing great. Yep. Right into your horse pose. Come to your toes. Arms above your head. Inhale. Hands to the mat. Hop. And come back down into your horse. Pause in your horse. Cat to cow. Cat. Cow. Exhale, cat. Inhale, cow. Exhale, cat. One more inhale, cow. Exhale, cat. Heels down, rise up to star. Right knee bends, warrior two. Reverse warrior. Hands to the mat, low lunge. Right leg high, wild thing all the way around, lower hips. Lift the hips. Right leg high, fall in triangle, slide the leg all the way forward and through. Left arm lifts. Left hand down, right leg high, flow chaturanga. So good. Feels great to move on a Friday morning. I can tell you right now I'm feeling real good. Hopefully you are too. Take a big breath in. Big breath out. Again, big breath in. Big breath out. Let's take the left leg high. Wild thing, come all the way around. Lower hips. Lift the hips. Left leg high. Exhale, left tricep. Left leg high. Exhale, right tricep. Left leg high. Exhale, left tricep. Left leg high. Exhale, right tricep. Left leg high. Come to the right tricep, spin to the inside of your right foot, right elbow, left knee, and then extend, lift. Three-legged dog, left leg high, take a hop. Step to the outside of your left hand, drag and lunge, pause for the inhale. Drop the back knee, half split on your exhale. Rebend your left knee, tuck the back toe, lift it. Skandasana to your right. Left knee bends, low lunge, drag and lunge. Drop the back knee, half split. Rebend the front knee, tuck the toe, skandasana to your right, maybe diamond shape. Left knee bends, low dragon lunge, heart forward. Drop the back knee, half split. So we're grounding, yes. Bend the knee. Lift the back knee, skandasana, see if you can maybe reach your arms forward. Right into low lunge, no hands, left knee bends. Hands to heart. Hands touch the mat for a moment. Shiva squat, bring your hands back to heart. Find your balance, rise all the way up. Inhale, take the leg forward, arms forward. Inhale, back in. Open the leg out to the side, inhale, extend, extend arms. Back in, tilt the body down. Tuck your left shoulder underneath you, lift your right leg. Half moon, left hand down, right hand to hip. Shiva squat. Five handstand hops. Hands down, hop, land light. Up, up, two. The last one is a step back to lunge. High lunge, arms above you. Interlace the hands at your neck. Push your elbows back. Engage a long stance. Twist to the left. Arms open. Exalt left hand, right thigh. Lean it back. Revolve lunge, right elbow, left knee. Really nice, very smooth. Look forward, step both feet together. Stay here or side crow, your choice, or fly your arms for four. Nice, three, two, look down to the mat, lift your right heel. Start to extend it all the way back behind you and drop the foot down. Hold here, stay for the breath in. Lift up to high lunge on the breath out. Inhale, warrior two on your exhale, open out. Reverse warrior, inhale, left arm high. Side angle, left arm comes down. Skandasana to your right, all the way down. Yes, really good. And then right into our wide horse pose. All right, so I'm gonna turn around to face you so you don't have to just look at my butt. <laughs> come to your toes, arms up, hands come down, take a hop. And come back down, right into your horse. Heels down, star pose. Left knee bends, warrior two. Reverse warrior, left arm lifts. Exhale, side angle pose. Skandasana to your right. 
Come into horse on your toes, lift your arms. Hands down, hands down, hop. And back down into your horse. Heels down, rise star. Left knee bends, warrior two. Reverse warrior, left arm lifts. Side angle pose, left arm comes down. Skandasana to your right. Come into your horse. Under your toes, arms up. Hands down, pop it up. And come back down when you are ready. Back into your horse. Same thing, cat to cow. Inhale, exhale, cat. Inhale, cow. Exhale, cat, you're on your toes. Inhale, cow. Exhale, cat. You really want to think chin to chest. Again, inhale, open. Exhale, close. Come back to neutral. Heels down, rise star. Left knee bends, warrior two. Reverse warrior, left arm lifts. Hands come to the mat, low lunge. Left leg high, wild thing all the way around. Lower, lift. Left leg high, fall in a broken triangle. Lift. Leg high and flow. Awesome work so far. We are moving and grooving this morning. Take a full breath in. We're almost done, last little bit here. Bend your knees, look forward. Big hop to the top. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. And then your chair, sitting low. Arms come up. Hands to heart space. Left elbow, right knee, chair twist or side curl. Hold for four. Three, two, one. Look down to the mat, lift your left heel. Send the leg all the way back behind you. Pause. Four, three. Notice your balance has changed. Two, one-legged mountain. Pull the left knee up and in. Whoo, yes. Adding a twist. Right hand, left thigh. Left hand behind you if you want more. Grab for your left foot. Extend it. Holding here for four. Notice your balance is on point. Three, focus. Two, and one airplane pose. Leg goes back, arms reach back. Here for four. Three, two, one Shiva squat. Okay, so either you take multiple handstand hops or you hold one handstand 15 seconds starting now. Go ahead, you're right up into it. 15, 14, 13, 12. Even if you come up against a wall, it's not bad. It's practice. Last 10, nine, eight, seven, six, Five, four, three, two, one. Both feet down together. Feet about hip width distance apart. Come to your toes. Sink your hips all the way down to your heels. Lower your knees down to the mat. Lean your body back. Maybe bring your hands to your heels if that feels good in a full camel shape. Just make sure that you're engaging your glutes and your core. Come all the way back up. Lift the knees. Hands down. Pro or headstand. Here for four, three, two, one, let's flow. You guys, we're coming up on the tail end of our practice, so really finish strong. Gotta even it out. Inhale, bend your knees. Exhale, hop forward. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Sit back well in your chair, arms up. Hands to heart space. Right elbow, left knee. Press, hold. If you want to take side curl, that's fine. Otherwise, hold for four, three, two, one. Look down to the mat. Lift your right heel. Extend the foot all the way back behind you. Pause. Four, three. Keep lifting the heel. Two. Rise all the way up into balance. Woo! Right knee comes in. Left hand to the right thigh or grab your foot. Extending your twist. Hold for four, three, two, and one airplane. Leg goes all the way back, arms reach back. Hold for four, three, lift the heel higher, two, one Shiva squat. Hold here. So again, 15 seconds, 
your hops or hold the hands down. Go for it. 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Both feet down together. Widen your stance. Hip down to heels. Knees come all the way down to the mat. Lean the body back. Your variation, camel. Here for four, three, two. Want to come all the way back around? Lift your knees. Crow or last headstand, your choice. This time we hold for ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and float chaturanga. Last flow. <sighs> Woo. All the way back to downward facing dog. Full inhale. Full exhale. Bend your knees. Look forward to hop to the outside digits of your mouth. Frog squat. That's a little bit just for the core here. Pull the knees in. You can always keep the heels down. It's totally up to you. We twist to right. Come back to center. Low boat pose. Come back up. Twist the left, back to center, low bow pose. Lift back up, twist to the right, back to center, low bow. Back to center, twist the left, back to center, low bow. Come back up, twist right, back to center, low bow. Come back up, twist the left, back to center, low bow. Hold right here, legs come up. Bend knees, heels to glute, extend legs forward. Legs up, heels to glute, legs forward. Remember, your head, neck, and chest are lifted the whole time. Just keep revolving. Yep, legs forward, up, heels in, extend. Four, stay with it. Head, neck, and chest lifted. Three, two, getting into those lower abdominals. Two, one, switch the direction, pull in, up, back down. Head, neck, and chest are lifted. Squeeze in. Make sure the lower back is glued to the mat. If it kind of wants to lift up, go slower. Three, two, and one. Knees come in, rock and roll forward and back. Back into your frog squat. Lean your body forward, holding here. So you can take this in to a back bend of your choice, or you can just kind of hold where you're at. Totally up to you. Again, you do not have to go here if you do not want to. So the left hand is gonna come underneath you, or right hand first. Right hand goes up and around, lift your hips, and you're right into bridge, or you can go full wheel if it's in your practice. Pivoting on the heel of the hands, dropping down and lifting for four. Three, two, come all the way back around. And go to the other side, left arm lifts. Extra energy today, you know? This is like how you energize yourself, lift your hips, Lift your heart, maybe you go all the way around, full wheel, find length, here for four, three, two, and one, coming all the way back around, lowering your hips down, slide your right shin in front of you, slide your left leg all the way back for pigeon pose. Drop your gaze down, deepen your breath. <sighs> enjoy this moment. Maybe you just start to push your right hip back, left hip forward slightly. I'm just going to rock a little front to back. Let's go ahead and switch. So left shin forward, right leg back. And same thing here, just kind of shifting the hips. Deep breaths. Deep inhales. Deep exhales. 
and go ahead and come back to a seat. Hands behind you, feet down, reverse tabletop. Just let your head drop back. Here for three, two, one. Hips down, legs slide forward, fold all the way down. Just let your head drop. Deepen your breath. <sighs> Come up to a seat. Any easy seat is fine. Crossing the legs. Lift your arms above you. Hands to heart space. Do two more clearing breaths like that. Arms up. Hands to heart. Last one, inhale, arms up. Exhale, hands to heart. Just taking a moment, thanking yourself for being here this morning, mind, body, and spirit. And to the wisdom and movement and everything you learn in every day, you can just take it in and let it be as it is, just seal it in. Not to judge it, but just to be present with it. And a moment of gratitude to yourself and the gratitude we share. And the third eye center. Hey, back forward. Namaste. Awesome practice, friends. Happy Friday. Ooh. Hope you feel good.